times we need to know how acidic or basic something is. Scientists sometimes use liquids to test that. If you have a pool or a hot tub, you might use a little test strip to test that. Today we have some litmus paper and we're going to test to see how acidic or basic these different things we have here are. We're going to start with some vinegar, right? I'm going to put some vinegar in this little dish. And Delisa, will you put one of my strips of paper, just dip the end right into that vinegar. Interesting. Let's pull it out and put it on here so everyone can see. What happened to that paper? It turned red. It turned red. That means that the vinegar is acidic because it turned red. Okay. Here's another one. We're going to put some soap into this one. All right? Let's put some litmus paper into here. Dip it in. Let's pull it out and let's see. It turned yellow. Yeah, I don't think there was much change. It just looks like it got a little wet. So what does that say about the soap? I don't know. The soap must be basic. Here, let's try the lemon juice. Have you ever drank some lemon juice or gotten a little bit of lemon on maybe a cut on your hand or your lip? It can burn, right? Is it, do you feel that burn if you do? Yeah, well, let's test. That burn is because lemon juice has an acidicness to it. So what color should this litmus strip turn if it's acidic? Red. Red, that's right. Another red one. It's interesting how acid base indicators work. They change color based on what's around them. They're influenced by their surroundings. You know, as we were listening to this week's story about the Israelites, they sure did seem like acid base indicators. They were influenced by what was around them. They had lots of ups and downs throughout the years. When there was a judge alive, they followed God and obeyed him. And then as soon as the judge died, they seemed to go straight back to worshiping idols. They just went back and forth, influenced by the things around them. I don't want to be influenced by the things around me, by what other people think is cool or good. I want to be influenced by, who should we be influenced by? Jesus. By Jesus, by God. I want him to be my standard, not the other things around me. As for me and my house, we will serve the Lord.